Anyway, my crime was, well, I suppose you could call it fraud. How about you? <laughs> a veritable criminal is amongst us. Hmm, I believe I understand now. Are you here on false charges? In the past, the names and crimes of prisoners were publicly posted. But about five years ago, those postings were suddenly discontinued. Possibly because there's so many of us now. But something tells me there's more to it. Wait. Quiet. I must have lost track of time. It seems they're doing their rounds now. The guards patrol on a strict schedule. Don't do anything that'll get you caught during patrol hours. Mm, now then, mornings come early here. <laughs> Best that you get some rest. That's all I need to hear about the Canaan Islands. The ancient machine that controls the weather, the Ark of Napishtim. I find it difficult to believe that a thing out of a children's fairy tale actually exists. But your testimony doesn't conflict with any of the Navy's reports so far. Yeah. Though I find it difficult to believe, the reports do not lie. And I admit you have been cooperative these past few days. Is that what you hoped I would say? Lies or truth, there's no doubt your so-called adventures have major repercussions. And you're still suspected of being a spy in the Imperial territories. That's not my problem. Anyone would have a hard time believing these stories. I don't even know why I'm the one who has to do this. Guard! Yes, ma'am! Hand inmate 217 over to the Empire to be tried for his other crimes. Take him and go. So they're sending you off? Just like that? I wouldn't be either. You did say you had a friend in the city. There's a rumor about this place. At the end of that corridor, there's a sector where even guards are forbidden. Supposedly, there's a hidden passage there, built when the prison was still a fortress. An emergency escape route, I imagine. I thought you might find it helpful. It's possible it leads out of the prison, but it's a labyrinth down there. There are also rumors of strange creatures prowling the tunnels. Not in the slightest. Rumors like this are the tip of the iceberg. We've only just met, but I already know you're not one to accept fate lying. I'm sure you'd have gone anyway, with or without my help. After all, you already possess something to pick the lock with, don't you? Good. You've made it out. That was a pretty neat trick with a fork. That was not my intention, I assure you. But I appreciate what you did in the mess hall.
<laughs> I appreciate the offer, but I'd only just slow you down. Don't worry about me. I'll be fine here. I've grown rather accustomed to these walls. Hurry now. You must leave the prison before the guards catch wind of your escape. I hope that one day we will meet again. He's not here! Sweep the area near the canal again. He can't have gotten far. Can we be certain he's here? He couldn't have made it through the aqueduct. It's a direct order from Master Shadowlord himself. We're to take extra precautions with this one. So keep it to yourself and resume your search before I have you locked up too. Yes, sir! Security fortifications in the agricultural district and the main gates. They're in place, sir. Good. Yes, sir. Sign of him? Nothing, sir. We've already searched the entire area. What's this building? It's just an old inn. It was closed about a year ago. We searched it and didn't find anyone. All right. Move out and continue the search. Yes, sir!
treasure chest. <laughs> Mind your surroundings, Crimson King. This place has become the cursed land. The Grimwald Knox. It is a realm where the line between the worlds of human and monster becomes obscured. For you, it is the front line of battle. Come forth, my monstrums, and consume this dark night! White Cat, reporting in. <sighs> Hawk, present. This had better not be another waste of time. Dull here. Good day. Raging Bull, I'm raring to go. <sighs> Renegade, let's get on with it already. Monstrums, meet the Crimson King. Now there are six of you. We have a new recruit. I guess we needed the extra help. <laughs> My condolences, pal. <laughs> That's a funny name you've got there, Crimson King. Raging Bull is also peculiar. Like you. They are monstrums. They use their gifts to exercise the monsters that infest this realm. If you fail to do so, you will be trapped here forever. And if you should die in this realm, your souls will wander it for the rest of eternity. That is the curse which all of you monstrums must bear. You'll obey me here on, or you'll regret it. There she goes again, sounding just as unreasonable as ever. That demented bitch. One day I'm gonna kill her. I don't like it any more than you guys. But this is the only way we can get back to our own lives. The clock is ticking. Now then, shall we begin? Monsters, the time is nigh. Under the red moons, the wicked and the defiant shall be punished. Ascend into this unbreaking night, unsheathe your curse, and smite the darkness.
<laughs> Impressive. I'd expect no less from all of you. Good. It seems the Grimwald Nox has lifted. You have much potential, Crimson King. Your power will be useful in banishing the darkness in the days to come. What? If you seek the truth about the curse, First, unveil the mystery of Balduk Prison, Crimson King. We've returned to the city. Typical. Leave it to her to scurry off as soon as her dirty work's done. <sighs> Okay, well, I'm gonna go home. I'll be leaving too. Oh, um... Um... <laughs> you got that right, new kid. I'm sure you've got a lot of questions, but you're out of luck. We don't have the answers you're looking for. <sighs> we still don't know why we're even fighting, nor what those monsters are. Nor why the Grimwald Knox comes. Yeah, and what's with those magic bullets? She used them to turn us into these things. Someone's desperate for friends. And we can't leave the city either. You can thank the curse for that. When she calls, we fight. We're nothing more than puppets. I'd rather be Monster Chow than be stuck another month in this dump. Yeah, I love this city, but there's only so much to do around here. Hey, look, they're on the roof! Mama, is that a monster? Shh, it's rude to point. Wait a second, are those all of the monstrums? Yeah, but I count six of them. Is the red one a monstrum too? Oops, we've been made. <laughs> the new kid's outfit sticks out like a clown at a funeral. We should disperse before someone calls the Roman soldiers or the knights. Very well. I shall take my leave then. Okay, I'll go too. Bye guys! I've been looking all over for you after I heard you escaped from the prison. Am I glad I found you before the soldiers did? <laughs> that right? I'm just glad you're okay. You can tell me what happened later. Huh? You look... Ah, never mind. Just imagining things, I guess. Anyway, now that you're a fugitive, you really shouldn't be out here. Did you find him? No. We've looked everywhere, sir. Oh, we can't let all six of them get away. Call for reinforcements. I want at least one of them in custody. Thanks to those monstrums, soldiers will be everywhere. We'd better find somewhere to lay low for now. That's a lot to take in. So that makes you one of those monstrums? A prison with monsters in the basement, a mystery woman with false limbs, and a curse that won't let you leave the city. Can't say I understand it all, except the part about being stuck here for a while. <laughs> Ain't much of an apology coming out of a wily smile like that. You're enjoying this, aren't you? <laughs> you goofball. Anyway, before we can do anything else, we're gonna need a hideout. The 
the basement of this abandoned building ain't bad. A hidden entrance like that would make coming and leaving a lot more discreet. We can fix it up enough to sleep here. Then we can talk about a plan. Yeah. Hmm, you got it. Just leave it to me. Yeah. 